Hello, uh, my name is Steve Kenworthy, Flight Lieutenant Steve Kenworthy. I'm the uh, Harrier Display Pilot this year from Number 4 Squadron over at RAF Wittering. We haven't been able to do it since, from, since 2006 because we've been in Afghanistan, which has been a huge commitment for the Harrier Force, but we came over from Af Afghanistan last, uh, last summer, so now we've got a bit more capacity to, uh, to do the display again. So we're here this year, we've got about 10 shows, uh, 10 weekends, um, and it's great, just great to be back in front of the public at the air shows. The reason we're doing a, a roll demo this year, it's um, because we, we're only just back from Afghanistan. We need, uh, we're spending a lot of time recovering some of the skills that we lost because we spent all our time in Afghanistan. So doing a full display is a big commitment for the squadron. A roll demo is a bit less of a commitment. Um, it's a non-aerobatic display really, so it's less um, currency uh, requirements, less of a workup for me as a pilot. So it's less of a burden overall on the squadron. The whole, the whole VSTOL side of the show is quite challenging. The wind on the day makes a massive difference. No two displays are the same because the wind is, is different. And unlike um, when you're flying at 300 knots or 400 knots and you've got a 10 knot wind, that doesn't make a great deal of difference. But when you're hovering at zero, um, 10 knots of wind makes quite a big difference and the, the direction changes a lot as well. So it's a very challenging thing to fly. Um, I particularly enjoy doing the bow because that's what everyone um, likes. But the whole V-Style side of things is it's just, it's hard work, but it's good fun to, um, and it's great for the crowd to see. It's great that I bring a team of six or seven engineers away with me. Um, it's it's a very much a team effort. They they're part of the team. They also have the black suits, um, and I rely a lot on them as well. It's great for me that I can. Um, fly the aeroplane, well, as soon as I've landed, I can then, or before going flying, I can just worry that, I don't have to worry that someone else, um, because someone else is going to be actually servicing the aeroplane for me, it's not my responsibility. Um, whereas other teams, not so fortunate to have engineers with them, have to service the jet themselves and then go flying, so it just takes a bit of pressure off me, which is, which is good. Um, but it's very much a team effort. And as Steve capably demonstrates, these aircraft are, of course, able to operate in virtually any weather conditions. And there it is, the wonderful Harrier, back on the display circuit again. How wonderful to see it. And also, Steve Kenworthy, big thanks for keeping on flying in extremely difficult conditions.